Uh, All right, we watched, I already forgot the name, Cloak and Dagger, um, which was kind of a sequel to the last one. Jesus. Um, For a Jew, I say Jesus. I like this episode more than the last one because there are more <laughs> clones in this one. <laughs> Only reason why Dimitri likes this one over the last but one. But too many of my babies clone. die. I'm sorry. You need to chill. I forgot the name of the clone that's the main clone in this one, but I like him a lot. The one with the two strips of hair? Yeah. And I can't, I don't remember if that's the same one as the one who was with Wolf in the first, in episode two with Plo Koon. I don't know if that's the same guy. They have really similar hair if it's not the same guy, and one of them says two for copyright infringement. <laughs> but about the actual episode, Ahsoka's not as annoying in this episode. No, she's pretty annoying. She said, yeah, no, I said, wow, she's annoying. She, stop grabbing it from me. You make it confusing. Mm -hmm. Anyway. <laughs> I make it confusing? Anyway, yeah, she needs to chill in this episode. <laughs> I just remember what the actual episode was. Yeah, she's like, use fear, and she's like, the Jedi Master doesn't know what she's talking about. And, um, and then the Jedi Master's like, you are right, Ahsoka. But, like, also, if Ahsoka was still there, she would have been able to help protect the Viceroy from being taken if Ahsoka had stayed. So, like, the other Jedi may have died. But they'd still have the Viceroy. Well, I don't like Ahsoka. I don't think I've ever liked Ahsoka. <laughs> I don't think I ever will like Ahsoka. You may later. She, really she, gets, she gets less annoying. She she reminds me of me too much when I was 12. <laughs> Not a, you mean who you wish you were when you were 12? <laughs> no, when I was 12, like how like how the way she talks, not the way she acts, like the way she talks. Like I was a lot of, like that. It's like this person is absolutely nothing when they're talking about, even though they're like an expert in their field or whatever. Because <laughs> yeah. rarely I talk like that when I was 12. Not much else happens. When we get another introduction of Ventress. We see Ventress in action, um, and she's cool again. But again. We don't see too much of her yet. Stop yawning on the camera. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm really tired. We but don't I still want to fosters. We don't see too much of uh, Ventress really until a little later. Um, she's still kind of the mysterious assassin who Mysterious Dooku has. Assassin. 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 Yeah. Who, assassin. who Dooku has and like that's it. Yeah. You know. Next episode's Kit Fisto. Who I'm really attracted to. That is, okay, that is <laughs> not what the episode is is called. The next episode's called Lair of Grievous. It just has Kit Fisto in it, and you need to chill. <laughs> I'm really attracted to Kit Fisto. Oh my lord. <laughs> and you're turned on by a ship. <laughs> what you're attracted to does not, like, it's not valid anymore. Kit Fisto, more like Kit Fist me. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> okay. Go away. Okay. Get out. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>